Hello and welcome back to Adam with Bong the Troll, who is now just walking through the caverns of chaos to get out in order to use ooh, unknown scroll. He is going out in order to use the shortcut into the the deeper parts of the caverns of chaos. So, yeah, last time uh, you might have skipped the last part of the video which was just me walking back to dwarf town and um, and getting some inventory management done um let's eat something here um yeah i addressed potions to increase my dexterity and eight more yoga roots to increase my willpower. Let's hope that happens. Um, I got a blink doggy corpse on the way. Uh, on the way, which I sold to the shop in Dwarf Towns, and now we have a backup blink dog. Um, backup blink doggy corpse. Should we ever need that? Oh, you annoying dude. Fireproof blankets. Well, I think I have enough of those. Ooh. Metal girdle. Uh Nah. Um <clears throat> what else happened? Um yeah, I picked up the blue dragon scale mail here. Uh, which gives shock immunity, so so that's good. I also recharge recharged uh, one of my wands of teleportation. Ugh. So let's just get down to the air temple and the real business. There, go down. You. <sighs> Let's. Uh, <laughs> whoops. Okay. First of all, what amulet do we want to use? Uh, I'll go with rapid healing. Uh, but what I wanted to do was to. Change out of the black dragon scale mail and use the blue. Like so. Um guess we should probably also bless it. Uh well, do we need to? Uh maybe not. Alright, now we can face this guy without any real worries. Uh, well he might destroy equipment, but Whew, okay, good. Um, we need to eat something here. Let's eat this dwarven sausage. Yum. All right. <clears throat> Where's this cavernous level? No. Screw you. Ah, oh, my bracers of regeneration rusted. Um, do we have... I do have a blessed oil of rust removal. Yes, eat. Okay, good. Um, I'm gonna just use or dip my bracers of regeneration into this oil of rust removal. Not sure if a blessed one should make them rust proof, but I don't know if they if 
that will happen when uh, when they are rusty let's see the rust is removed they didn't become rust proof nah. and here we are this is the level with the air temple so I'm gonna have to drop all my items here so they don't get destroyed um Eternium, Eternium, those should be okay. Crystal. I don't know really the necklace, the rings. The braces of regeneration might be vulnerable to destruction. I guess the gauntlets will protect the rings, right? Light crossbow will. Probably be vulnerable there to um, okay. So let's uh, call on D and drop everything. Okay, quick break there to do some more research, and um, yeah, I'm, I'm sticking with this. Uh, well, maybe not necklace of rapid healing. Uh, and the cloak of protection could probably be destroyed. Let's do that. Um, the Ankh is an artifact, so that won't be destroyed and can probably be a bit useful, so let's do that. Uh, Ankh. I'm not too worried about the Cloak of Protection. Uh, defense, I mean. So. Drop. And we need a Wand of Ding, which we have tons of. Do we have many Humanoid Slayers? Um, let me um, actually pick up everything again. Yes, whatever. And read a blessed scroll of identify. Um, so, girl of greed. Uh, la, 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 la. Let's see here. Should have well, skull crusher is a humanoid slayer, so that's fine. Um, but it would have been <clears throat> would have been nice to have some humanoid slaying ammunition. Except I think we have one quarrel, maybe, but uh, two quarrels. Okay. Well. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do is drop everything and pick up um, There we go, Thunderstroke uh, I'll take the Orb of Elemental Fire I'll take need some digging. There's one. Um anything else? I want to drink a potion of insight just to see um, what we have. Uh, as far as intrinsics go, should 
probably take some kind of healing uh, with us. Although I think we will, it won't be too bad, but the the boss or the dude in here um, is the master summoner, so we can summon everything, even you know, ancient dragons and all kinds of scary stuff. So um, I'm considering the orb of the uh, water orb. It will corrupt, but it can also heal. Or it can heal, but will also corrupt when it heals. That makes more sense. I'll take it with me. Uh, let's not filter. Mm. Anything else we could need? I don't know. I don't think so. Um, yeah. Let's eat something before we go. This blessed iron ration should be good. Let's equip on the orb of fire. And why are we? Um, <clears throat> let's see. Let's do thunderstroke and let's drop the squirrels. Uh, somewhat tedious. Let's drink the potion of insight and see what we have. Yeah. Um. I have intrinsic acid immunity. How did I know that? Why? Why do I have that? It's excellent, but wow. I hmm. we're immune to shock. That's through the dragon scale mail. Shock paralyzation resist, stun, notification, sleep. We're lucky and smile. Uh Fate smiles. <laughs> Fire resistant intrinsically and through an item and poison cold and acid resistance. Yeah. Um yeah, I think we're doing pretty well here. Uh but acid immunity intrinsic. Mm, not sure where I got that. I have to look it up at some point. Anyway, this has been 15 minutes just of preparations to get into this temple. So let's actually now go in. Um, I'll do it from here. I think. Um, zap. Yeah, now it starts. Lightning bolts. Resist. Aha, here we are. And uh, the <clears throat> our invisibility helps a lot, of course. Just gonna have to <laughs> plow our way through all these demons and stuff. this just want to get don't want to get hungry in uh, <clears throat> in this fight you know we are wearing one two four um, artifacts actually which does increase our hunger rate ooh raw meat that's great Bong love the raw meat, yes. Oh, we, oh yeah, okay, shit, there's uh, a whole lot of traps here. And this fire giant king is uh, a bit tough. You feel corrupted, shit. No new corruption, but... Uh, I should have had. S I might go back for a wand of trap detection uh, later. Let's let's deal with this outer area first. So 
Yes. <clears throat> uh. Come on. I'm out of hunger. No thanks. Circuit King. Yuki. And that looks like <coughs> the um, outer part is done. I don't care about acid. And I think there are some... There is a secret door, yes. And... This guy is Yulgash, the Master Summoner. He doesn't care about you. Oh, really? I'll make you care about me. <laughs> Let's just punch through... Oh, Lord, the air grew. That looks... Uh, gruesome. We seem to be doing quite well. I I do want to take out Yulgash fairly quickly before he starts summoning horrible, horrible stuff. Yulgash, where are you? Whoops! Oh, we lost our cloak of defense. Yeah, I was sort of expecting that to happen. here. Oh well. Oh. oh, we need a crossbow. <laughs> Light crossbow of accuracy. Good. I, <laughs> I forgot to take a crossbow with me. Uh, lucky we found one then. Oh, there is um, Yulgash. Pow. Okay, it returned, yeah. Pow. <laughs> you might regret putting so many traps here now, Yulgash. Shoot him. Shoot him, and he's down. Excellent! That wasn't too hard. Let's <clears throat> get the orb of elemental air and the corpse. And let's just... Ugh. Kill all these guys, I guess. Whoa!
Ah. Okay. That's better. <clears throat> Okay, a blue amulet. Hmm. Uh, interesting. Anything um, else? Hey, so. uh, no. All right, that was the. Ooh, heavy crossbow. Yeah, this was the air temple. <laughs> um, a lot easier than I feared. Oh, oh, oh God! It's a rust monster. Jesus. Uh, let's shoot you. I hope they haven't been stealing my stuff. No. Pick up everything. All right. Um, that went really well. Obviously. Um, um, I guess we'll just keep the blue dragon scale mail on because. Uh, since we have uh, intrinsic acid immunity, there's no point in using uh, uh, blah 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 the black dragon scan mail. So check out the heavy crossbow. It's well, uh, I don't know. <clears throat> Anyway, let's get back to the cloak of protection. Uh, no, 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 that's not what I meant to do. Let's remove that note from um, no, that note. Yeah, and the ank we switch out for whatever uh, defense. Alright, so now what? Do we go further down, I guess? What else? Um, oh, look, my, 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 my willpower has gone up to 21. Excellent. Let's eat a couple more Morgia roots. Yes. So. Dungeon level 39. Wow, we're getting really close to the, the end. A certain tension. Um, okay, so this episode is 25 ish minutes. And there's a mimic. Mimics can paralyze, I think. I'll use the free action. I wonder is. Oh, yeah, this is an entire. Uh, Shop full of mimics. <laughs> oh, 700 XP. Uh, I don't know, is it worth it? It's a greater mimic. Ah, come here. Ah. <laughs> Balance, any good loot from these guys? One of lightning, cure poison. Nothing wrong with those. <clears throat> Item detection might come in handy. Well, I have several of those already, but you know. <clears throat> kill, kill, kill. 
emeralds. Could be good. Eat. Oh, we're, we're super hungry. Uh, rawr. <laughs> raw and bloody meat. Great. Oh, what I should do is go up to Dwarf Town with the corpse of the Master Summoner. I do. Yes. Um. No. Okay, oh, it's, eh, it's a bit boring to keep going up and down, but, well, you know what, I'll do it, but I won't record it, so I'll end the episode here and go up to Dwarf Town and sell the corpse and uh, all that, and, uh, and go back down, so you'll see me again here in the next episode, yeah. I guess that's a good plan, so thank you for watching, and um, until next time, take care.